Jade Gabrielle, welcome to my channel. Today I'm wearing my wig cap because I'm coming at you with a, another wig review. Okay, so today I am unboxing the Outre Natural Yaki series. Um, this is the Natural Yaki in 24 inches and I have her in the colour DR27613. So I thought I would try blonde because it's summer and I thought why not. So <laughs> here's the packet. So yeah, let's take her out and try her on. Okay, so here is the wig. As you can see, she is super long. I actually want to take a minute just to say that this wig looks slightly yellow. Um, this wig take this wig looks slightly yellower um, with me than it does on screen. On screen, it, it's looking a little bit lighter. But kind of the yellowy hints that you can see on the screen is how it's like it all is. It's quite quite a gold shade. Okay, so cap construction. There are one, two, three combs in the front, and two of them are quite well. One of them is quite close to this L part which they've got in there, and then they've got another comb just here, right at the back. So as I said, it's super long. And it's very blonde. Okay, so I'm going to try her on, leaving the lace on just so I can kind of get a feel for her. Here we go. Okay, I'll fix her. I'm just gonna do a side part because that's my favorite. I love the texture of the hair. It's it's definitely yakky. It's not like super silky like some wigs are where you feel them and you're just like, oh, this doesn't feel real. Like this feels like, it feels like really good quality hair, even though it is a synthetic wig. It feels really nice. Uh, what's really nice about the top as well, it's that it's not a straight black. It is like a darker brown, which helps to blend it into this really nice blonde color. I'm just gonna, I am 5'5". Five five. And I'm just going to back up a little bit so you can kind of see how long it is. It's quite long. So if I do a little spin, still got the card on. So I bought this wig for $28.46 and I got it from wigtypes.com. Um, I ordered this wig two days ago, I did UPS ground and it is here two days later which is absolutely fabulous. It's kind of difficult for me to be able to tell just how big head friendly this wig is at the moment. Um, so my head is a little bit of a big head, um, so I do like a big head friendly wig. Um, but I do have my hair in um, two braids, two um, cane rows, two corn rows even underneath this, but I put Marley hair in them so they're like super long. So I've tried to put them, um, like tried to squeeze them underneath a wig cap, but it is like a little bit tight. So I think if I was going to wear this wig out, which I definitely really want to because I'm kind of in love with it, um, that I would need to take the Marley hair out just so it makes my wig cap feel a little bit tight. Um, just so my wig cap can fit a little bit better. Um, another thing that I really like about this wig is that it is already layered. So in the front, I've got these shorter bits and then it kind of works this way down to the full on 24 inches of length. Um, so that's really good. And that just kind of helps to, it just kind of flows really nicely. And I love that it's not dead straight. I mean, I suppose it probably was supposed to be dead straight, but because it's been in the packet, it's got a little bit of a wave in it, which I think is really nice. Yeah, I really love the colour. I think it goes really well with my skin tone. And from what I've seen um, with other people on YouTube is that it goes well with lots of different skin tones. Like it's just... So yeah, this wig, it is heat resistant up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit with like your curlers or your straighteners, whatever you want to do to it or try and experiment etc etc but so far I love this hair and the parting so this is the parting before I've done any work to it um, this is it just as is um, it's not too bad I think it could do with just a little bit of powder just to try and make it look a little bit more natural 
I'm actually really loving this wig and I think that I might even go back and get it in a darker color as well just because I wasn't expecting it's it's just brilliant it feels really full the hair especially as it's like a yakky texture it feels like really full like you feel like you've got a full head of hair it's not one of those thin wigs which is why I went for this one over some other blonde wigs that I was looking at um, because I, I just felt like this one was going to be thicker from what I'd seen of it online and it definitely is I think it's really great Okay, well, thank you so much for tuning in to my unboxing of this Aitre Natural Yaki wig. I'm going to leave the link to where I purchased this wig below, and I'm also going to leave the links to my Twitter, my Instagram, and my written blog. So please do check those out. Please do like this video, please do subscribe, and I hope to see you again soon. Bye!